Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and a very good whatever time it is you're watching this video. So in this video, I'm going to tell you why the hell you go make things so complicated. Wait a minute, that doesn't sound right. I'm going to tell you why ain't nothing but a heartache. That doesn't sound right either. Snap out of it! Okay, so in this video, I'm going to be telling you some of the things that I wish I knew before entering college or university. Firstly, I wish I knew that my SPM results wouldn't matter anymore. But I studied for three months to get those results! Still doesn't matter. Those results did help me to get into university, no doubt about that. But they didn't really serve any purpose afterwards. So if you think the string of A's that you collected while you were studying in school is going to help you in university, you are badly mistaken. Once you enter uni, it's a level playing field. The person who got a million A's and the person who got just a handful of A's will be equal in university. So you study really hard for your SPMs, you use those good grades to get you into university, but then you take those results and hang them on the wall and never speak of it again. You start again, you work really hard to succeed again. And the thing about being in university is that you can't really delay your working hard phase until the end of your studies and your know, final years because it doesn't work that way. You need to work hard from the very beginning, from the first semester if you want to succeed. And inshallah, your hard work will pay off. Next, I wish I had the sense to not waste so much of my time. So to everyone watching this video, I implore you, please make full use of your time. Entering college, I was younger and I thought I had a lot of time to do whatever I wanted in the future. And now future me is here and he's face palming so hard at the idea. <laughs> But seriously, you will always regret the time that you wasted. Because time is made up of life. Your life. And if you are wasting time, you are essentially wasting your life. So, maybe someone will ask me, Bro, abis tu macam mana do? Nak buat macam tu? Der do? Siapa gai do? And my answer would be, don't let yourself get bored. Whenever you're bored, that's a sign that you're wasting time. So how do you not get bored? Do something! Do something that interests you, anything. Whether it's finding the answer to a question that makes the world interesting, or a project that you really want to do, or make something that'll kick people's figurative backsides. Whether it's a robot, or a book, or a lamp, or a song, or... Just don't allow yourself to get bored, and make full use of your time. Next of all, just because you're in university, doesn't mean that you have to stop doing what you like doing. I realized this later than I would have liked. Upon entering college, I was like, I'm a college student. That's that. I allowed myself to be defined by where I was when there's so much more to it than that. So to the good people watching this video, try to wrap your heads around the idea that you have more potential than you believe. Then start looking for what you like doing, what interests you, what you enjoy. And do those things when you can. This is especially true to the people who didn't manage to get into courses that they wanted to and got into some other course. And to those people, I would say, treat those courses like a part-time job. It's still something that you have have to do or need to do to get by. And when you're not doing your part-time job, you can start working on your real job. Whether it's painting or writing or making music or lamps. Enjoy those skills and enjoy doing what you like doing, regardless of what you're supposedly studying. And I'm not saying here that you need to stop studying. Please, that's very wrong. If you have to do it, you do it. And you do it well. So that when you finish, nobody can tell you that you didn't work hard enough to succeed. Study whatever you have to study, but pursue your interests. I believe that's where you'll find happiness. And at the end of the day, that's all you want, right? Happiness! Last but not least, I wish I knew that sometimes life would seem unfair. And that's perfectly fine. But you need to go on. Don't rebel or give up just because of some bruises. It doesn't make any sense. It's like a football player leaving the field because they got fouled. Fouls happen, sometimes intentionally, sometimes unintentionally. But we need to keep on playing. We have to stay on the field and finish the game in order to have a chance of winning. And even if we lose, we lose with dignity. Obviously, there are a lot more things that I could tell you. But I'd like you guys to go out and seek some successful people and see if they have any advice for an aspiring undergraduate. I'm sure they have much to share. And that's it for this video. Links to some other videos over there. And an announcement. There's this Teen Ace program going on from the 29th to the 30th of June in Setiawangsa, KL. It's a very good program. The 
only thing not good about it is that I'll be there. <laughs> You're pathetic. I recommend it to anyone who might find themselves free on that weekend. I'll put a link in the description box so you guys can go click to find out more stuff about it, more information. And with that, may peace be upon you. It's been so long since I've been in front of the camera.